Hey there, welcome to another marriage replenishment message from The Color of Marriage. Have you ever pondered why love often comes hand in hand with hardship? It's a profound question that brings us to the heart of marriage's secret strength. This strength is beautifully depicted in the Bible, where Jesus' love for the church is portrayed. This love was not a simple effortless feeling, it came with sacrifice, endurance and an unwavering commitment. In a marriage too, we encounter different forms of hardship. Some may be unintentional, a product of past hurts, misunderstandings or human failings. Others may be intentional, a deliberate attempt to exert control or manipulate situations. These tribulations can test the strength of our love, forcing us to dig deep and discover the true extent of our commitment. Yet in the face of all these challenges we should remember the example of Jesus, who remained steadfast in his love for the church, despite the hardships. Just as Jesus remained steadfast in his love for his bride, the church, so too must we remain steadfast in our love for our brides, through the ups and downs of life. One might ask, why endure hardship? Besides being a non-negotiable command as mentioned in various passages of scriptures, the answer lies in the rewards that come from enduring hardship out of love. When we navigate through the stormy seas of life with patience and perseverance, we are weaving a stronger bond of love and understanding. This bond, though invisible to the eye, becomes the anchor that grounds us in times of turmoil. Just as a diamond is formed under immense pressure, so too is the depth of our love and commitment to our bride revealed through hardship. But remember, these rewards are not immediate, they are the fruit of enduring patience, the result of relentless perseverance, and the blessing of unwavering faith. Just as Jesus won over the church through his ultimate sacrifice, your love can turn the trials of life into stepping stones towards a stronger, deeper, and more passionate marriage. Enduring hardship out of love is not a sign of weakness but a testament to the strength of your love and commitment to your bride. Now, you might be thinking, how can I apply these principles in my own marriage? It starts with patience, the kind that is mentioned in 1 Corinthians chapter 13 verse 4 and Romans chapter 12 verse 12. Recognize that your bride, like you, is a work in progress. Sometimes, hardships arise not out of malice but out of past hurts or misunderstanding. Practice seeking to know your wife's heart and mind instead of rushing to judgment and don't forget to apply the instructions of 1 Peter chapter 3 verse 7. Next, cultivate a spirit of forgiveness. Ephesians 4 31 32 gives us a great example of this. Just as Christ forgave the church, so too should you forgive your bride, releasing any resentment that could poison your relationship. Remember your marriage is a journey, not a destination. It's about growth, not perfection. Lastly, keep your faith in God strong. This is exactly what we are directed to do in Proverbs chapter 3 verse 5 through 6. It's through faith that you'll find the strength to endure hardships and the wisdom to navigate them. God's love will be your guiding light, illuminating the path to a stronger, more fulfilling relationship with your bride. Keep the words of Psalm 119 verse 105 in mind as you seek wisdom to work through the hardships of marriage. Here's what they say, your word is a lamp to my feet and a light to my path. Remember, the journey of love and hardship is not one that you walk alone. God is with you every step of the way, guiding you towards a stronger, more fulfilling marriage with your bride. If you need help putting this into action, the Color of Marriage Christian Marriage Counseling is here to help you work through the hardships of your marriage. Consider our Extraordinary Husband Masterclass or maybe a dual session with you and your bride is what you need. Let us help you move your marriage to greatness. Keep this in mind and watch the transformation unfold. If you haven't already, please subscribe to our channel to see more videos like this. Also, if you agree with this message and feel others should hear it, please share and like it.